Zakela Toyin. I teach chemistry at Okwebi Senior Grammar School. My name is Otayemi Damelola and I'm a teacher in Fazloma Senior High School and I teach physics. My experience with the IBL method of teaching has been fantastic so far. At first it was a little challenging but so far so good. Um, it's been so interesting. The more I practice, the more I get used to it and it helps to achieve so much. It's student-centered. So the students, out of curiosity, they find out things themselves. So you give them a topic, they go and discuss about it. They come to the front of the class to present to every other classmate, like they are the ones teaching themselves. The teaching style has changed because we now do group discussions in class. Um, we present ourselves in class like we come together as groups to talk about a certain topic. The way they're teaching now the class is more interactive, we've been shared into groups and we are able to work in groups whenever we've been given class work or assignments or practical. And whenever we are interested in the next class, we are going to do presentation and the class is even more fun. My experience in using digital lab to teach my students has been awesome because it actually reduced, I don't understand, I don't understand the kind of question because they are literally doing it themselves. They are seeing it, just like what we do today, they are seeing it. So just write what you are seeing. Not that I'm just telling you, I'm telling them to imagine. Some of them, their imagination can be out of what they are supposed to imagine. But now they are actually operating it themselves. They are seeing it, they are seeing the changes. It has really made teaching easy. And when they hear how we are going to computer lab next week, they are always, like, they are always looking forward to that time. Just like the IBL method, Digital Lab has actually made um, the teaching and learning process easier. With the use of the Digital Lab, I've been able to um, observe a lot of changes, positive changes at that, on the aspect of the students. Like I said, it helps to arouse their interest. It also helps to sustain their interest during the duration of teaching, compared to when you are just talking to them abstractly but with the use of the digital lab it helps to sustain their interest that even at the end of the class they still don't want to leave the class they want it to continue digital lab has made my interest for um, science higher than how it was before because i now view, i now see science as a daily life um, stuff not longer as a theory but as what I do in practical life, in my real life. My experience is in digital labs. Okay. I would say most of the pictures or the images on the digital lab, how they are, like for instance, state of matter as we did today, where they showed us liquid states and solid states and gaseous states told us how it transforms when it's being heated or when it's cooled. I think if teachers should always be doing this, we would be improving. Yeah.